As you know, immigration has become a big in this um, election. Uh, all You and all of your rivals want to secure the border. If you become president, what do you do next? Well, after securing the border? Well, first, you have not just secure the border, you, people have to have confidence that you're doing, that you've done it. In essence, I do not believe, having worked on this issue now for a long time, including just personally having come from the background I come from, that the American people are going to support anything on immigration until first they believe that illegal immigration is truly under control. That means finishing the wall and fencing, the new border patrol agents, an entry exit tracking system, and E-Verify. Only after that's in place and that's working can we go to the American people and see what they are willing to support. I think they'll be willing to support something very reasonable. I don't think the American people expect us to round up and deport 12 million people. If you're a criminal, you won't be able to stay, no matter what. They should be deported now, criminals. If you're not, we've outlined an idea. You know, maybe the, I, I don't know if the American people will support it, but the idea of allowing people that have been here for a long time to pass a background check, pay a fine, start paying taxes, they get a work permit. And that's, the, that's all they'll have for at least a decade. But we'll see what the American people are willing to support. I'm not going to ram it down anyone's throat, and I can tell you how we're not going to do it, through unconstitutional executive orders the way this president's done it now.